Touchscreen control for election graphics, sports, weather or news is seen every day on major broadcast stations around the world. With Touch Graphics and Lyric Pro, touchscreen control is now available to every station in the world. With a Chiron graphics system such as the MicroX, LEX or HyperX, and an inappropriately equipped touchscreen monitor, setting up these user-definable hotspots is fast and easy. Okay, let's start with this simple scene and show how fast and easy it is. I have a scene with two arrows on the bottom of the screen and a headshot over a background. I'll create hotspots on the arrows to move the headshot left or right. First of all, let's create two transition timelines that move the headshot left and right. Add the first transition and name it right. And let's add the group. Down at the one second mark, move the group to the right. Now let's copy this transition and give it a new name called left. To speed this up, let's just click on the object in the timeline and check reverse keyframes, which does just that. A reverse animation going from right to left. I want to add one more step. I don't want to have a mistake on air with someone hitting the left arrow and forgetting that the headshot is already in the left position. That would reactivate the left animation, which would look bad. So, in transition properties, all you have to do is check the prevent reactivation, which prevents the left animation running again, unless the last animation was the right animation. Check this for both left and right, and we are done. Now, navigate to the transition properties and click on config hotspots. The available nodes window shows everything available that a hotspot can be configured for. You can either select it in this window or select it in the scene graph. Click on the arrow right and click add. These are your choices. Follow the node means that the hotspot would follow the green arrow if it was also moving around the screen. Toggle the boundaries allows you to draw the hotspot where you want. Used node extents uses the object that you have selected as the hotspot. Let's use this one. Now click on the Reactions button. You now have three choices. You can select a Condition Rule Manager, which is assigning a conditional transition that we went over in the previous tutorials. We can assign a macro to run when touching the hotspot, or we can assign an activation, which I'll do. Now it gives me the available transitions, left, right, or default. Since we are working on the right arrow, the transition to choose would be right. Now let's do the same for the left arrow and we are ready to test the scene with touch control. You can still check your hotspots even if you do not have a touchscreen monitor using your virtual frame buffer in your offline version of Lyric Pro. Play the scene to air and using your mouse you are able to test the hotspots. Click on the right arrow and the right effect starts. Click on the left arrow and the left effect starts. Click on the left arrow again and you can see that it will not start the animation over again because we checked prevent reactivation when building the scene. Now let's go back to the weather condition map we created in the previous tutorial. I added the names of the cities down the left side of the scene with the intent of adding touchscreen control to them. We designed the scene using inherent state and now adding touchscreen control will complete the scene. I have already added the control to all the cities except the last one. Open up the top group and city names group and click on Rome. Now click on the config hotspots button. Click add and select node extents. Click on reactivations and select activations from the drop down list. Click add and select Rome from the transition list and close and OK to get out of the menu. I added a hotspot for reset on the weather conditions text at the top. Now play it to air and clicking on any city name on the left will perform that transition. And because we also used inherit state, we can go from any city to any city without any problems. This is something your on-air talent can use with ease. Touch graphics in Lyric Pro is easy to set up and easy to use by any staff member in your facility. Use this for elections and you can see the possibilities with touch graphics from Chiron.